Hey, everybody, how are we doing? Well, I'll tell you something. It's, uh, what is it? It's Wednesday. It is Wednesday. Notice my new bench over there? I freaking love it. I got more space now. I smashed off like four or five axes. Oh, man, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Hey, this video is a little bit different. You guys know me, what I do. Uh, there's a subscriber on the channel. Actually, he, he doesn't comment much. He's not, he's not a big commenter. But I'll tell you something. He's one hell of a man. We could call him an axe man, I would believe. He's, he's been a huge support to the axe program. Okay, you've heard me say his name, Kenny Barnett. Okay, and we've, when I switched to the online shipping, all of a sudden they didn't take P.O. boxes or something like that. Forget, I don't even like going there, that stuff. I, I'm not used to that kind of stuff. Okay, so, but anyways, Kenny Barnett stuff um, is, is beautiful. And, and Kenny's a great guy. He asked me, I actually just read it in an email, and Kenny, it's taken a while, but I read through the email again, is Kenny wanted to see how um, us, the tree guys, or myself, uh, roll up a rope. And I'm not going to, there's lots of videos on that, but he, he's my subscriber. He asked me to do it. I'm going to do it for Kenny Barnett. Kenny, this is for you. Now, Kenny, this is what I do. Okay, now if I'm coiling up my rope and my rope's way over at the tree and I come walking over with it tied on my belt, I won't start the process until I actually bundle it up right in front of me. So I'll actually almost bundle it twice. I'll pull it all in and I'll put it there. Do you know what I mean by that? But to save the video, I'm just explaining it. So once it's sitting here in a clump at your feet, okay, what I do, Kenny, and what a lot of tree guys do, I think actually Mike Duffy's got a, uh, uh, Mike's a good guy, he's a tree guy, he's got a, uh, a video on, on coiling up the ropes. So what I do, Kenny, is I just leave the pile at the bottom of the ground there. You know, I'll just put it so you can see it, Ken. You know, here, here we are. You can pretty much see what's going on there. Okay, buds? Now... What I do is I just throw out, I'll take, let's see, one, maybe two arm loads and just throw it out to the side there. And then what I do, Ken, is I just start coiling. It's not like coiling in an extension cord where you're lifting up like this. See this? And by the time you get to the end of the cord, your freaking shoulder's ready to fall off. You're throwing your whole body into it. Don't do that. This is what I do. I'm going to get close to you. Have a watch at this, okay? I just, this hand stays in this position the whole time, right like that. And what I do with this hand is I just grab the rope and I use my fingers in here as kind of a little, a little catch, a little guide. You see, like this, I go one, two, drop, and I turn it and coil it in there. Then I go one, two, and I coil it and drop it in there. Are you seeing that all right, Ken? Okay. One, two, one, two. But I catch the first one. You, if you want, you can just do one, drop, one, drop. But again, your shoulder's going way up like that. My shoulders are hooped. So I, I just go like this, one, two. And you kind of coil it. Once you get a few coils, can you just drop it right across your arm? Drop it right across your arm like that and just, just start going. So you're never, it's so easy. Look what I'm doing. I'm going to go a little quicker because you're a smart man. You get the process. So I'm just... They tend to get a little twisty as they come. Just twist them out as they come. You see, so we'll start that again. So here I am. It's right over my hand. The fun part is at the end. So I just go one, two, two short ones. And I turn it as it comes in, Ken, or it's going to go figure eight on you. Like this, I'll show you. Watch. See it start twisting? It's starting to twist. So I, some guys don't care about that, but whatever. I give it a little twist. I think Duffy does. I think we all do, actually. So you can see it starting to twist up there. So just give it a flick, Ken. But but just work it like this. This arm never moves, buddy. This right arm catching all the weight, it never moves. I just give her one of these. This is only a short rope. Okay, but it's important to turn that as it comes in. You see that? How it's kind of, you see? So it's basically one arm. This whole left arm is doing all the work and my fingers are sitting here. See this middle finger? It's just holding as that it comes in on that first one. See, drop and then twist and then in, in it goes. So that little hand just sits out there and works like a little, looks like a little gremlin in there. And he just does his job by kind of twisting and turning and holding the rope as it comes in. You see how that's working, Ken? So it takes a few times. So there it is. Now, this is the part that's fun, I think. So what you do now, this is what I do. 
So it's sitting on this arm. You just basically join your hands together like this. Bring this one right through. Hold the rope. Whew, throw that one out there like you've never seen it before. Grab the tail, which will be closest to your body. It's right there. Now, this is the part where guys kind of get a little bit screwed up at some point. All you do, Ken, is you turn this into your body. Go to reach for your armpit. See if you can grab your armpit. You know what I'm saying? So just reach for that armpit. You can't get it, so you, you kind of try and twist a little more and just turn that around. So what you're doing is you're going this. Okay? And pull it tight. Reach for that armpit. Go for that pit. You can't get it. Couple, three spins. Okay? So now you got this. So it's sitting there. Now you just grab this here like this. Pull this through. But don't pull it all the way through. We call it a daisy knot. Leave this like this. Come up again. Do another one here. Do another one there. And then I, I just finish it off like this. There's all kinds of ways you can finish it. But that's it. The daisy knot. The rope's nice and clean and tidy. And it comes out like a dream, Kenny, when you get at the tree. Yeah, I tie it off my hip like that. So once you undo that daisy knot, you just grab that rope and whoop, this thing just comes right undone. You see the old daisy knot? Poof, there it is. You can drop that down once you know where your rope's coming out. It's coming off this side. You can drop this down right there. Look at This is the exciting part about this, Ken. Look. You see what I'm saying? It comes off like a dream. Okay? So, so, so that's why we do that. Okay? No problems. Now, when we do this in speed mode, when it's time to wrap up the job, Ken, Kenny Barnetto, Mr. Barnett, my good friend Kenny Barnett, man, your axes, they should be there midweek. One, two, throw them down, here we go. You see what's happening here, Ken? So it's very, very, uh, a very simple, kind of a no-brainer method once you get it down. It will take a few times. I remember when I first got doing it. Don't do great big coils. Just do short coils because when you tie it off your hip, you don't want it dangling in your feet and around in your spurs. You want it hanging at the back of your knees, maybe calves. You know, ankles is fine too. But you, don't, you definitely don't want it in your, in your freaking spurs and down beyond there. You see? So there we are. That's done. Switch hands again, Kenny. Whoo! Fluffling. Reach for that armpit. Up it comes. Turn it around. Pull tight. Pull tight. Turn that around. Pull tight. And away we go. Let's pull that through there like that, Ken. You see? Boom. Kenny Barnett. That's for you, buddy. Hey. Hey, Loaded Dog. Is that your name? Loaded, loaded Dog. Was that it? Some guy subscribed, and he he subscribed in. Welcome to the channel, bud. You looked like you weren't sure there for a minute or two, but it seems like you got welcomed uh, with a with a red carpet. So welcome, and I hope you're enjoying yourself. If not, uh, you'll figure something out. Thanks, guys. Mush, well done. Over and out.